الحمد للہ وسلاۃ وسلام رسول الکریم اما آباد اعوذ باللہ من الشیطان الرجیم بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم مائی ڈیئر بردرز اینڈ سسٹرز ان اسلام اینڈ ان ہیومینٹی السلام علیکم و رحمۃ اللہ وبرکاتہ میں پیس مرسی اینڈ بلیسنگ آف اللہ بی اپون یو ٹوڈے مائی ٹاپک از Why does Islam prohibit eating pork? As the creator and designer of human beings, Allah knows what is good for us and what is not. And He says, O oh, you believers, eat from the good things which we have provided for you and give thanks to Allah if you truly serve Him. He has only forbidden you carrion, blood and pork and whatever has been consecrated for other than Allah. But whoever is forced without willful transgression or habit is not to be blamed. Allah is forgiving and merciful. Al-Quran 2 verse 172-173 Muslims, therefore, rely on the divine wisdom in observing these prohibitions. which does, of course, not stop them trying to find out why certain potential food sources are prohibited, whereas with alcohol this is more straightforward, as the harmful effects of intoxication can easily be observed. It is less obvious with the foods, which do not develop symptoms immediately. In the past, it was thought that the prohibition was due to the risk of tap worms, which is greater in pork than in any other meat. But recently, through DNA studies, it has been observed that the structure of pig cells is very similar to that of human ones, which is why pig organs are used for transplants, as they are the least likely rejected. And if this is true, Eating pork almost comes close to cannibalism. Another reason why pork might be considered unclean is that a pig's diet is not strictly vegetarian but can even include feces and their own young. And a key prohibition in Islam is meat from predatory animals or scavengers. السلام علیکم و رحمۃ اللہ وبرکاتہ